The Bulls got back to their winning ways here at the Sun Dome as the USF women's basketball team beat Seton Hall 67 to 56. Despite the win, head coach Jose Fernandez felt like his team could have played better. You know, at the end they got hot and they made shots and we let them back in and it, it, it was, uh, we cannot down the stretch play the way we played those final seven, eight minutes. Um, because it was it was disappointing how we how we defended down the stretch. We had to pick our defense up, especially in transition. So uh, we we had to make adjustments, you know, switching and and finding them in transition, pretty much. So yeah. I think we we you know we get into the point where we we get some lulls in our uh, we go two three minutes where we just struggle scoring, you know, and uh, we got to we got to fight through that. Coach said at the beginning, before we started, that it had to be an up-tempo game. They didn't really stick with us, you know, the first time we played them. So we knew we just had to keep it up pace in order to get the win. Again, we came out of the halftime, and I think it was 14-2 to two out of the gate. Uh, those first four or five minutes out of the second half. Then we subbed, and we went to our bench, and, you know, uh, we got to get guys uh, more accountable for their play. You know, I thought Akilah McDonald, was very, very good tonight. I thought Ingo or Kova had a very good offensive game. Courtney Williams and uh, Alicia Jenkins, two freshmen, played very well. Williams and McDonald had a solid evening as they both recorded double doubles in the win. The Bulls will need another strong performance from the two of them as they face a tough opponent on the road in Louisville on Wednesday night. Reporting for the Digital Bullpen, I'm Tyler Smith.